God bless America. God bless all of you guys for coming out. God bless Colombia. I'm so blessed to live in a free society, a free capitalistic country that we can make these decisions to renovate and to expand and to grow. So we have many things to be thankful for. Oh, say, can you see? So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous night or the Hey guys, it's King Ranch 13. Welcome back to another video. As y'all saw, my wife did the national anthem for the grand reopening of our grocery store. And you know, it's just our local grocery store here, but so much more than that, you know, we're all about community. Uh, same with our business, Outdoor Trucks. We'd like to take care of our community, try to donate, and try to give back as much as we can. But anyways, that was my wife, so proud of her on the job she did. Beautiful voice, she is so talented. But anyways, we're gonna get going on the rest of the video. I don't even know what's gonna happen in this video. Make sure to hit that like, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below and let Summer know how well she did. Got something in the mail today. And what might we use this for, you may ask? Dun, dun, dun. Here's a little shot of the eraser wheel from yesterday. Oh, I didn't, actually, I, I need to finish that. But then I also picked up some actual polishing compound. Uh, and I'm gonna try it out, try out that pad here, or one of these pads. I really don't know which one's supposed to be for a rough cut and whatever. So I'm just gonna use this blue thing first and then maybe use this one. This one's softer, so that's for a finish. So hopefully that will look pretty good. So yeah, we're gonna get to cleaning, get to work, and then we'll see here in a minute. I can kinda get this residue off. Let's get it. So let's see if this stuff works. And if you're a detail guy and stuff and you know how to do this and I'm doing it the completely wrong way, making fun of me in the comments, I guess, but I'm gonna just give it my shot, I guess. Okay, so this is what it's gonna stick to. That, oh, there's a blade inside there. Oh, that's pretty neat. And then this, okay. I'm following now. Okay, so it looks like this is more of like a coarser eraser wheel and then these are the more smooth ones. I'm gonna use, I think these are the exact same so there's two of them that came in this pack. Let me use this one. Let's try this out. So let's try it out here. Well, 
puts a bunch of stuff out this is how much I've used of it doing this part there but check that out basically got everything out um, obviously it leaves some of that residue from the eraser but uh, I think I'm gonna go back with one of these polish deals I guess and use that to polish it up because you can barely barely kind of see some of that you see let me see if we can get those out all right finally got my old car show glaze thing i don't know how it's gonna do but give it a try i guess i think that's a lot what do you think <laughs> yeah it's gotta go everywhere smells good does it yeah well i got a little whiff of it and it kind of smelled good This morning we've got Colin back over here helping me out. So just getting some stuff cleaned up. Cooper did an awesome job helping us out on the baseboards. So gonna do a little cleanup, little trip down of this truck. Yeah, I gotta get things presentable because we got something coming up here in a second.
guy, but it's pretty sharp. <laughs> Well, sorry y'all, yeah. I'm not King Ranger 13 anymore. I'm Platinum Daddy 12. Oh God. I said King Super Duty, I thought that was funny. <laughs> no, we're still gonna be King Ranger 13. So the reason why we got the Platinum, so I, I, I always need to explain myself. So this, this is y'all's explanation. Don't, don't hate on me too much in the comments. So the reason why we got this one is because the truck market's starting to go back down. Finding a King Ranch that I wanted right now. Buddy reached out to me about my dually, so. I was like, well, I'll let go of the dually. It is a lot of truck right now. I did use it a good bit. I love towing with it, but I think this will do the job for now. Uh, for now. But this is gonna do for now, and I know right as of right now, we don't have a King Ranch yet. So y'all have to make sure you hit that like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. For now, Platinum, I mean, it's super nice. I can't complain, I'm not gonna be like, oh, I'm only King Ranch man, which I am, but I'm not gonna be like stuck to my ways, I guess. I, I've, this year I've already gotten a GMC and I have bought a Chevy. <laughs> I haven't stooped that low to get a Dodge yet. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'll get a Dodge sometime too, and we'll maybe one day we'll have all three. So let me know down in the comments below what uh, trim level of a Dodge you think I should get or becoming I should get. Um, I'm leaning probably towards the Laramie Longhorn, but for right now, 
got a platinum, got the Denali HD, uh, and we're just gonna roll with it for now. I always like to change out vehicles and stuff like that. Hopefully y'all are enjoying that. <laughs> I'm going through a lot of different trucks, and that way y'all get exposure to different vehicles by following me and not just seeing just some stuff about King Ranches, even though, I mean, y'all know I'm a diehard King Ranch fan. Y'all can go check out my Instagram to see <laughs> all the trucks that I've had. But thank y'all so much for watching. Don't hate on me too much, like I said. Follow along on this build, and we'll see what we do. Take care, guys. Bye.